Sodium didionite is a white crystalline powder with a weak sulfurous odor. It is the sodium salt of didionous acid. Although it is stable under most conditions, it will decompose in hot water and in acid solutions. It can be obtained from sodium bisulfite by the following reaction. 2 NaSO3 plus zinc Na2S2O4 plus zinc 2 structure. Raman spectroscopy and single crystal X-ray diffraction studies of sodium didionite in the solid state reveal that sodium didionite exists in different forms. In one anhydrous form, the didionite ion has C2 geometry, almost eclipsed with a 16 degrees OSSO torsional angle. In the dihydrated form, the didionite anion has a shorter SS bond length and a gauche 56 degrees OSSO torsional angle. The weak SS bond causes the didionite anion to dissociate into the SO2- radical anion in aqueous solution, which has been confirmed by ESR spectroscopy. It is also observed that 35S undergoes rapid exchange between S2042- and SO2 in neutral or acidic solution, consistent with the weak SS bond in the anion. Properties and reactions Sodium didionite is stable when dry, but is slowly oxidized by air when in solution. Even with the absence of air, solutions of sodium didionite deteriorate due to the following reaction. 2S2O42- plus H2OS2O32- plus 2HSO3- Thus solutions of sodium didionite cannot be stored for a long period of time. Anhydrous is a monoclinic crystal with slightly sulfuric odor. It is soluble in water and slightly soluble in ethanol. Dihydrate is a columnar crystal, and it is so unstable that it easily dehydrates to anhydrous and is easily oxidized by oxygen in the air. Anhydrous gradually decomposes to sodium sulfate and sulfur dioxide above 90 degrees Celsius in the air. In absence of air, it decomposes quickly above 150 degrees Celsius to sodium sulfite, sodium thiosulfate sulfate, sulfur dioxide and trace amount of sulfur. Powdered anhydrous sodium didionite with a small amount of water may ignite in air by the heat of decomposition. In absence of air, it only decomposes slowly. An aqueous solution of sodium didionite is acidic and decomposes to sodium thiosulfate and sodium bisulfite. The reaction rate increases with increasing temperature. In addition, the rate is higher under stronger acidity. 2 Na 2S2O4 plus H2O Na 2S2O3 plus 2 Na SO3 In presence of oxygen, it decomposes to sodium bisulfate and sodium bisulfite. Na 2S2O4 plus O2 plus H2O Na SO4 plus Na SO3 Sodium bisulfate and sodium bisulfite decrease the pH and therefore accelerate the reaction. Sulfur dioxide is formed under strongly acidic conditions. 2H2S2O43SO2 plus S plus 2H2O3H2S2O45SO2 plus H2S plus 2H2O. On the other hand, alkali solution is stable and only decomposes about 1% per an hour. It has strong reducing properties and decomposes to sulfurous acid and sulfide. 3 Na 2S2O4 plus 6 NaOH5 Na 2SO3 plus Na 2S plus 3H2O in the presence of aldehydes. Sodium diethionite reacts either to form alpha hydroxy sulfonates at room temperature or to reduce the aldehyde to the corresponding alcohol above a temperature of 85 degrees Celsius. Some ketones are also reduced under similar conditions. Applications. Industry This compound is a water-soluble salt, and can be used as a reducing agent in aqueous solutions. It is used as such in some industrial dyeing processes, primarily those involving sulfur dyes and vat dyes, where an otherwise water-insoluble dye can be reduced into a water-soluble alkali metal salt. The reduction properties of sodium didionite also eliminate excess dye, residual oxide, and unintended pigments.
thereby improving overall color quality. Sodium didionite can also be used for water treatment, gas purification, cleaning, and stripping. It can also be used in industrial processes as a sulfonating agent or a sodium ion source. In addition to the textile industry, this compound is used in industries concerned with leather, foods, polymers, photography, and many others. Its wide use is attributable to its low toxicity LD50 at 5 grams per kilogram, and hence its wide range of applications. It is also used as decolorizing agent in organic reactions. Biological sciences Sodium didionite is often used in physiology experiments as a means of lowering solutions redox potential. Potassium ferrocyanide is usually used as an oxidizing chemical in such experiments. In addition, sodium didionite is often used in soil chemistry experiments to determine the amount of iron that is not incorporated in primary silicate minerals. Hence, iron extracted by sodium didionite is also referred to as free iron. The strong affinity of the didionite ion for bi and trivalent metal cations allows it to enhance the solubility of iron, and therefore didionite is a useful chelating agent. Geosciences Sodium didionite has been used in chemical enhanced oil recovery to stabilize polyacrylamide polymers against radical degradation in the presence of iron. It has also been used in environmental applications to propagate a lay front in the subsurface in order to reduce components such as chromium. Photography It can be used as a developer, but it is a very uncommon choice. It is prone to reduce film speed and, if improperly used, quickly fogs the image. Laboratory aqueous solutions of sodium didionite were once used to produce Fieser's solution for the removal of oxygen from a gas stream. 